Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, if it's your first time here, welcome. And if you're returning, thank you so much, welcome back. Um, early morning and Semper and I are heading to the beach, so I am uh, no makeup, no anything, just going to chill out on the beach with Semper for an hour or two to wear him out before work. And I wanted to get my Sensi video done, uh, my empties, so I am caught up on my videos um how is everybody i feel like i could go back to bed i need to drink a cup of coffee bear with me today i was just watching summer too as i was putting my empties together and she started off with about she has it's her makeup video free video too i'm like who cares nobody's here to look at our makeup they're here to look at what we're warming right Okay, so my first empty is I got done with a fragrance flower. And this fragrance flower has been going since like November in one of my bathrooms. It is Winterberry Apple Tea. As you could see, I colored it a little bit. I, um, so it wasn't, it was like not dying. And then I watched a video and I wish I wrote down, you know, a lot of times I watch videos as I'm walking or I'm driving or as I'm working. Um, so a video, somebody had said that if you're finding your oil is not disintegrating, is that the right? Disintegrating. Take the flower out and let it sit for like a day, like out of the oil to dry this, the rope off and then put it back in. So I did that. And now I did it with another one too. I pulled the flower out for a couple days in another bathroom. Um, yeah, I don't know. But then my cousin Maria was telling me, you gotta remove the plastic that's on here. So I guess now that this is dry, as I'm, I'm doing this as I'm, yeah, there's a plastic coating on. No, that's the wire. I don't know. My cousin's telling me about a plastic on here. I got the next flower I open before I put it in the oil. I got to see if there's a plastic piece on it. I don't know. She said that's why my oils aren't going. Um, dryer disc. Still smells good, but don't ask me what the name of it is. It doesn't have the name on here. I want to say it's like an Arctic kiss. I don't know, but that's gone. I have my recycling here. That's all the non-wax I have. I do have a car bar in my car. I got to change out, but I did, just didn't do that. I keep forgetting. Um, I am in Patricia Gates's melting challenge. So as I pull things that I used for the challenges, I will let you know. Um, okay. Um, May on June. No. Where am I at? June 2nd. I wrote five, I wrote five two. I'm like, no, I've already done my early May empties. I meant to put six two. It is Melt a Wax. That is one of the rainbow colors. So I actually did Rainbow Sherbert. And it's like a red, orange, so part of the rainbow colors too. It's orange zest, sugared strawberry, and key lime. This is a powerhouse. I love Rainbow Sherbert more as i say it all the time more is a blender like to mix it with a aqua, something aquatic um fresh cut grass a dirty a earthy scent i like i like doing it like that but i did do this on its own in the bedrooms and it is strong which i'm not complaining i love strong scents um i did arctic kiss i don't know what day we've had the past week it's been getting warmer, but we have had still like, I wake up in the morning and it's 56 degrees some days and we've had a lot of rain. Um, so I pulled Arctic Kiss, but Arctic Kiss is a year round to me. It's cool mint, fresh air and vanilla. This, this to me is I can warm this. I'll warm this year round. I did put it in my club too. Um, maraschino sugar cookie. Love this. I have four bricks of it that I got in a clearance and it's in my club. It is so good. So, so good. 
Um, as a matter of fact, it was one of my friend's birthdays and it's her favorite. I was almost going to give her one of my bricks, but I'm like, I got her other things too. And I'm like, I can't give up one of my bricks. So I gave her two bars because it's in my club. So I have a little bit, a few bars. This is sugar cookie drizzled with sweet maraschino cherry glaze. So, so, so good. I think that scent brought me around to loving cherry. Um, pink haze. This is in my club. It is confection of berries, nectarines, vanilla, laced whipped cream, and marshmallow fondant. Love it. A couple times I almost cut it from my club because I have so many backup bars because I just don't pull it a lot and I don't know why. But um, I'm happy I didn't. Every time I warm it, I'm like, yeah, don't cut it. Um, on the 30th, we had mint, mint julep day, melt any mint or alcoholic beverage scent. So in the game room, I did mint fields. Mint fields is peppermint leaves, spearmint leaves, greens. It just came back, but now it just, it came back, but it just left the catalog again. And I do have it in my club. Love it. I kept it in my club even when it came back because we had it. It left for a while. We had it like a year ago. Then it just came back in one of the collections. I hope you got this in your club if you're a mint lover. Um, Starburst Sky. Starburst Sky, I loved more last year than I am this year. I don't know why. You know, your nose changes. It's sweet apple, whipped vanilla, creamy coconut, amber blossom. I still do really, really like it. It is in the catalog. I might put it in my quarterly if it leaves at the end of the season. I don't know. I probably will. It's not one I pull often. I think I really loved it when it first came out. And maybe I'm, I don't know why. Um, I got through two strawberry swirls. And I know when I was pulling my basket, like making sure I had set notes and stuff, I did them two different days. So I must have did strawberry swirls since my last empties and then pulled another one. So I have a bunch of strawberry swirls. It was in my club and I did pull it out. This is just like a strawberry milkshake and I love it. But I did cut it from my club because I had so many backups. Um, from our Making Memories, Moment by Moment, I say Making Memories, Moment by Moment Collection, Graduation, Crisp Apples, Musk, Rich Suede Leather. I don't think I have any bars of this left. I know I have a couple of Moment by Moment Collection bars left, but I might have a graduation in there. I know I have Newborn Nursery. I don't know. I gotta look which ones I have left for those. On the 21st, Strawberry Showdown, melt two blends to pick a winner. Well, I did many blends. I had some of my vendors going throughout, and um, in my game room, I did Coastal Strawberry. I grabbed 10 bars of this in a clearance we had last year. I wish this would come back. I love this so much. And I had said in my empty vendor video, I can't pick a strawberry. I loved every one I, that I did in all the rooms. It was just a great day. All day and night, my house smelled of all different kinds of strawberry scents. I loved it. It's an earthy strawberry. So it's just like you picked that, you were in a strawberry field and picked it off the vine. A very earthy strawberry. It's not sweet at all. It's a fruity straw. This is what the set notes say. Earthy, fruity strawberry vines with raspberry seeds over jasmine. So, so good, guys. Coastal strawberry, if you ever see it in clearance. Garden Fresh Gardenia. I don't know if this is still in, um, in the catalog or not. I know we had a lot of things that left last week so I'm not sure if this is still available I did put it in my club I really like it but it's not one for open concept I like it like bathroom and down by the bedrooms but I like it a lot oh it's from the happiness blooms collection oh maybe it is it became available April 22nd so I don't know if it still is available it's gardenia petals fresh air and lush greens really good 
I put in my club just to grab a few more bars. It's not going to stay in there. It's not like, oh, I love it. I can't live without it bar. But I would like a few backups for those days that I just want to smell that kind of like a florally kind of scent. On the 16th, we did warm a sea style scent. So I did by the sea. Love by the sea. This does go in my club. It is ocean air, dewy seaside grass. Love it. And I did to beach. Beach is papaya, honeydew with a hint of coconut. So beach was in my club when it came back and bring back my bar. Not the last time, the time before. Somehow it disappeared from my club. I don't know if it's because maybe I did a skip a club or something and it's removed this. Then it came back. I was so excited. I put it back in my club. It left my club again. I did not take it out. Two times I had this in my club. It left and I did not take it out. Um, Alexis called and told me it was in clearance one day and I went in and I've got like 15 bars of it. So I have so many backups, but still I'm upset. Um... I'm not upset. I'm just, you know, like, don't sweat the small stuff, but it does. Cherry Vanilla, a year ago, January 23, this was in our Bring Back My Bar, Cherry Vanilla, so I put it in my club. I love it. On May 3rd, we did Mix It Monday, which was yesterday, Mix a Fruity plus a Bakery. So I did, it was so good in my kitchen. I mixed Almond Croissant. And then I had, I mixed, I had half a banana left and then a full one. So I finished these off. So it was almond croissant with bananas was my mix bakery and fruity day. Um, Berry Sweet is one of our new scents. And I brought my catalog in here. It's fresh strawberries, red strawberry. I'm sorry, start again. Fresh blueberries, red strawberries, sweet candy glaze. It's one of my top favorites of our new collection. This one and the Bamboo, Bamboo and Rainfall um, are the two that I'm really loving. Um, Courage, it's out right now. It's maybe in our mental awareness or something. Let me see if I wrote it on my note. The She Is collection, I guess Mother's Day then. Okay, it's bold raspberry, red mango, and pink amber. Wasn't crazy about it. Like, I'm not going to grab any more of this. So, it was a one and done. Then, it was a rainy, cold day. And I wanted pumpkin. So, I mixed pumpkin cinnamon swirl that's in my club and king cake. Didn't mix, alternated. So, the king cake is... Sweet crust of cinnamon brown sugar coated with golden butter. Love it. This I have in my club. And pumpkin. Both are in my club. So I actually could say I did this and we did do a... Oh, today is Melt a Love or a Club scent on the 4th. I didn't do this today, but this covers that day, I guess. No, wait, because I mixed... No. This, was, this is what I have going right now, today, in my kitchen, and in here, and in the family room in my kitchen today. I had a few pieces of coconut lemongrass out of this brick, so I emptied this brick. I got a new coconut lemongrass brick with my last club order for half price. It is creamy, tropical coconut, sunny, bright lemongrass. It's so, so good. So I have this going right now. I just had a few pieces left, cut them in half. And I alternated warmers in my kitchen and in here with Rum Pum Plum. That is a favorite of mine. Rum Pum Plum is sweet plum jam, vanilla sugar, flaky buttery crust. Oh my God, I love this so much. So this covers, this is what I did today. They're both, well, one is a club set and it's a love and a club set. On the 17th, of May, it was graduation day, melt a set in your high school colors. So my high school colors were orange and blue. So I did glorious grapefruit for the orange. 
and I alternated sip and poolside. So I did this throughout my bedroom and Jacqueline's bedroom and I alternated warmers. It was so good. So I did grapefruit and the poolside. Our poolside is one of our 10 new scents and it is fresh pear, sparkling citrus and aquatic accord. Really good. I'm liking it. I got a few backups. I have to warm it more through the summer to see if I love it to grab some more bars at the end of the season. Am I going to put it in my quarterly? I don't know yet. I have to warm it more and pay closer attention. But this was my Melt High School color day. And that's it, guys. That is the end of my Scentsy empties for the past, like, I think like two weeks, two and a half weeks, something like that. All right, let me know below what you are warming. And um, on my community page, I always share Patricia's melting challenge. So um, here's June's. So this is on my, um, my community page. So it's page one and page two. This goes up to the 15th. And then the second page goes up to June 30th. And every day is a prompt. And... I love it. I've been doing it for over a year. Patricia, like, is so good to do this for us. It, it's helped me so much. So, all right, guys. Have a great rest of your week. Love you. Bye.